Hi guys. Welcome back to my channel. Today I have an interesting macrame plant hanger to share with you. This week's macrame has a pretty special design. It is added with a dry branch to create a more impressive and better look. However, the plant hanger is not difficult to practice even if you are a beginner. To make this project, you need to prepare 30 to meters of 4 millimeters cotton rope. The length of this macrame is 0.7 meters about 28 inches. Please kindly note, the macrame can be shorter when you put any pots in. This plant hanger can be hold a variety of pots from 10 to 15 centimeters. Let's get started. First step, you take eight cords, three meters long, fold in half, and then you put them on the branch. Please pay attention to keep the two ends of cords always equal. I put it down on a flat surface so you can easily follow the next steps. First, you divide the cords into four parts, pick one and lay it across its neighbor. Then you lay next part across its next neighbor. Repeat the same process until the fourth part. Then you pull the fourth part through the space at the corner of first part. Pull and tighten the four parts together. This knot is called crown knot. Repeat the process until you have a length of about 8 centimeters. After finishing, you have a piece like this. Next step, you use one cord, two meters long, fold in the ratio 0.71.3. Then you tie a lark's head knot to attach the cord to the branch. Please note, the shorter end is at the right and the longer end is at the left. Next, you use the longer end to make the working cord and tie about 10 to 11 lark's head knot.
After finishing 11 lark's head knots, you tie it to the other side of the branch. Next, you take a cord 0.6 meter long, fold in half and attach it to the left side. You tie alternating half hitch knots. Each side is about 4 centimeters. Next you use 4 beads and 14 cords, 0 point to meter long to make to tassels. The cords to make the tassels you should use single rope. That will make it easier for you to straighten them. Next step, you make cradle to hold pots. You tie a snack knot. The distance from the branch to the snack knot is about 30 to 35 centimeters. Make two loops and pull the two ends through the loops. Do the same with the next chords. Please note, adjust the knots to be on an even horizontal row. Tie one more similar row and the knots are staggered with the knots of the first row. The distance between two rows is about 4 to 5 centimeters.
do the same to more rows. Last step, you use one cord, one meter long and tie wrap knot to fix the bottom. You fold the cord to make a loop and put the loop on the bottom area. Then you use the longer end to wrap around the loop area to cover the loop and all the cords. Next, you pass the wrapping end to the loop and pull the other end to bring them both inside. Finally, after finishing all the steps we have a beautiful looking macrame like this. And I'm sure that it will fit right in with any your home decor style, bohemian, rustic decor, minimalist decor and so on. I hope you enjoy this video. If you do, please a quick like and comment really does help my channel out. And please don't forget to subscribe my channel to update new macrame tutorials as soon as possible. Thank you so much for watching. See you next week.